Salutations and good morrow everyone and welcome back to another Grounded Update video where today I'm going to be going through and showing you guys the location of the brand new Green Shield Beetle and a couple things that are dangerous about him and a couple different ways that you guys will be able to cheese this boss and also going through and just showing you guys generally how dangerous he really can be by going through and attempting to fight this thing with not even full health and going in as you would to be a little unprepared. But before we go any further make sure you guys hit that like button, don't forget to subscribe and also please leave me a comment down below. But let's hop in and let's talk about it. First thing we're going to do is talk about location. Location, location, location. That's everything when it comes to this guy. He is stuck way over here in this area. How to get over here, you ask? Well, you got to go all the way up through this new area over here and get into the actual end of the wood update zone, which is this entire backyard corner right here. So how to get up there? First thing you're going to need to do is climb up a rock that's bent over right here. Careful, there's a wolf spider that sleeps underneath it. The next thing that you're going to want to do is then make your way over here through the tipped over barbecue area or the spilled barbecue area okay you want to make your way up over here as you're making your way through over here just be careful that you don't get burned by sizzle then what you're going to want to do is follow all the way through the grass be careful of canyons they're all over the place but follow through the grass all the way back to this area until you see what looks to be a giant um well it's literally a giant bag of fertilizer is what it is so yeah, you guys will just come over here and you'll see this giant bag of fertilizer. Okay, so once you are in this area and you find this giant bag of fertilizer, you're going to want to climb on top of it and climb over the back of it. Now, the unless you're like a super explorer, you may just see this and be like, ah, giant bag of fertilizer, whatever, and just keep running. Don't do that because there is the giant shelled green beetle back here, the giant shield beetle right back here. And he is just a giant stink bug, as you can see from him blowing off his green goo back over there and he is very very dangerous this thing has almost three times more health than your standard uh stink bug does it does have a lot of health but this thing it also can take a hit as well so that's why i would consider this thing to be on par with like a mini boss and there's only one of them so far so i would say yeah he probably is a mini boss for you to go and fight in this update so that is why i called this video the new green shield mini boss because he feels like one especially with how dangerous he is now let me talk you guys through a couple different things before we go down there and start to tangle with him yes it does work to wear a gas mask when you're fighting him Yes, it does break it extraordinarily fast, so you're going to want more than one. Is it smart to go in here without some sort of healing items? No, don't do that. But I'm going to go and run in here and do it anyway, just to show you guys how much damage he really can do. But the most dangerous thing about this guy, nonetheless, is his gas attacks. As long as you can get rid of that, you're not really going to have a problem. Also, another little fun tip as well is he does tend to get stuck inside of this giant pistol every now and then. So just be careful that you don't get him stuck in there. If you do, you'll be able to cheese him, but the fight's not going to be as fun. So let's run down here and see how much damage that he can do before I run away and try not to die. Because I probably will end up dying from trying to fight him. Because I'm not wearing a gas mask. Now this is a set of roly-poly gear. And it also is a set of, uh, it is a level 7 Salt Morningstar as well that I have to fight him with. Oop, I got him, I knocked him silly that time, so that was lucky. Hit him one more time, now I'm gonna back up. I'm just gonna kinda keep running away from him and hope that he doesn't do a gas attack. Let him do his little jumping gas attack. Run away! And you can see how quickly my health just gets destroyed as soon as I try to fight him. Oh god, run away, no... No stamina, no stamina, run! Okay, gain all your stamina back. Wait for him to come near you again. Ow! So, like a normal stink bug, he has most of the same stink bug's attacks. Um, the only thing that really stinks about him is the fact that he stinks, literally. Um, that he just wants to hurt you. Now, you could just stand up on top of one of these things, like um, if you're an archer, if you just kind of got up here, you probably could just shoot him with a bow for the most part. But this is what I was talking about with him getting stuck. He's now stuck right here. And with him being stuck right here, he can't really do a whole lot against you other than his gas moves. So... 
that's what's going to end up killing you, but he can't actually jump forward at that point. So you will be able to get over there and fight him that way as well. I would suggest arrows and a gas mask, but I died obviously trying to fight this guy. So that is the location of the green shield beetle. Right now, the only thing that it drops is stink bug parts. It doesn't actually drop anything new. So for now, that's just what it's dropping. It's not dropping anything cool. I'm assuming that that is going to get fixed in future updates. I will keep you guys updated as long as they keep on pushing out patches. And as always, I'll see all of you guys in the next one.